What's up, my love bugs and love muffins? It's Mama Love. I got something I gotta show y'all. I just want, you know, I was just doing my hair and something said, share something with them. I wanted to share something with y'all. Well, it's new to me, but it might not be new to y'all, but you see these, see this? Uh, my hair is dry like on this side and I washed it the other night and that was like, um, I don't want to keep washing my, my hair or like trying to just like redo the curls and I usually like you know how you brush through it and stuff anyway I got a spray bottle and uh I filled it with hot water and uh I figured out a way to like finger comb through my hair without tearing your hair out and what I did was basically spray through my hair like I'm doing such light like now and I noticed the more that I sprayed through it hot water through it because our, our hair does need a lot of hydration a lot of it uh, and when I'm I noticed that when I'm spraying through with the water the hot water I don't have to each tangle that my finger gets caught at I spray it with water and it pulls through and um I've been tearing my hair out all this time this is what I wanted to share with y'all and so then I go back in here and I got this uh argan oil leave-in conditioner and I just like go through and I spray it you know, I spray. I already did this size. So I'm just showing y'all something about how I wanted my curls to um, kind of pop. Put this on me. Hold up. And then I noticed when it's wet, you know, you want it to kind of like dry out a little bit. But look how my hands go through that. This I have not combed this out or brushed this out. This is the straight like with my finger and a hot water leave-in conditioner. After I spray the uh, hot water, I go back through it with the leave-in conditioner. And now, now I have my hair on this side. Um, you know, look at the curls, the, the tight curls that I have. Okay, so I'm like, okay, so how am I going to maintain this look? How am I going to keep this look? Because, you know, when it's dry, this is not going to be like this. So I bought this stuff, this extreme uh, professional gel, this extreme gel by extreme. And I use it because I did a wash and go. So I'm figuring this is how I'm gonna do it. I got some African she butter. And everybody say and know that uh, she butter is good for our hair. And so I'm getting a good amount on my hand. And what I'm gonna do is, um, rub it in real good. It usually kind of melty, but I'm not worried about that right now. So hopefully this don't leave no yellow film on my hair, but if it do, I'm just gonna uh, rub it in real good. It don't matter because it's gonna get, yeah, blah, 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 blah. It's about to get, I'm put some gel over it. So before I apply this gel on my hair, I'm gonna apply the she butter. And I'm gonna do that because I want the moisture in, in my hair that the she butter gives. The leave-in conditioner just softens the hair. But the, I have all kind of mousses. I have all kinds of pudding. I got curl boosting jelly. This is one of them I want to show y'all. I bought so many products for my hair. Um, this is Curls Unleashed by ORS, ORS or whatever ORS. I have that and um, it, it works pretty good. But to me, it, um, it dries fast. Don't nothing out of all the products that I have bought to wear my hair in a, a natural state. Um, out of all, I bought the, uh, as I am family, all the products and, and to that. And, um, I also bought the line of products to, uh, the cream of nature argan oil. Uh, I bought, all, I got all the whole line of products to this. I didn't like can too. It didn't do good for my hair, but the strength and leave-in conditioner. This is the bond.com y'all. It's bond.com. And I use it, uh, often, all the time. I always, whether I'm wearing my hair straight or whether I'm wearing it in this state. So anyway, I use this gel. What I'm trying to say is this gel worked better than all the line of products that I bought for my hair. It worked. And I went spending all that doggone money, you know, and I'm pretty sure it's gonna be more products and stuff that I wanna try. You know, I wanna get that down all into the ends, up to the roots, get to the root of the matter. And, uh, yeah, I feel like the Three Stooges when they do that. Some of y'all back in my day, I used to put that grease all on their head. Well, not the Three Stooges, but it was how he used to slap their hands together when they thought they was really doing something. Okay, so I got all this she butter. 
she butter all of my hair and I don't see any yellow product do y'all and these yellow from the she butter no it all blended in and it feels soft right now it feels really soft I got some thick hair y'all um the top part of my hair is different from the from the middle back here is real dry and resistant and kinky like you can see see the, see the but up in here is more of like a looser, silkier type of look. Yeah. But anyway. So I put the she butter in and she butter feels good. Um, that's how it look. Kind of don't want to put too much in there because I don't kind of like I don't want to cake it up and stuff like that. So now I'm going to use this gel that I showed y'all. This I think it's a bomb.com. the gel that's how much I'm gonna put in and I know I should be sectioning this off but I'm not because I'm in a rush I gotta go do something got stuff I got to do I got stuff on the flow I got on the flow so anyway I'm putting a gel gel through the hair by the way y'all I, I, I'm enjoying my natural hair I really am I really am um I love weave but uh and i and but i had stopped i said i'm gonna start doing my hair like braiding it all up real good and i mean you know neatly and braided and putting stuff like oils and stuff in it and uh and then i'm gonna put a uh you know a, a nice lace front over it whenever i do want to wear my hair i'm just not gonna take the time and so have my hair sewed in no more um, I'm going to buy those pretty lace front wigs and stuff like that. They, and not the cheap ones either. I, I don't. I got one. It's really pretty. It's really natural. And I think it's, I want to say, dang, Brazilian? Wait, y'all seen me in it before. Um, and I still have that. And that hair lasts up to uh, over a year. You know, but um, I don't buy beauty supply uh, hair. My girl, Andia. Andia uh, Robinson. Uh... At, and Jeff Hudson out in Detroit, y'all, with the with the hair unit, with the wigs, okay? And they and at Southfield and Seven Mile Evolution Hair Company, I am giving them a shout out because I'm telling you, when I, I'm when I go to Michigan, which is gonna be sometimes this week or next week, it's gonna be next week. Um, that uh. I'm, I'm going to hit Andia up because I'm telling you, she got them lace front wigs, okay? And I ain't never seen nobody apply a lace front wig like she does. Oh, my God. That woman. I miss you, Andia. So, um, this is the gel that I put in. I probably didn't put that much as y'all can see because I don't want it all cakey and stuff like that. But just to show y'all, look. And see? Now, I'm going to tell y'all what I was doing. Um, I was taking my hair... I'm gonna let that dry because that looks kind of, you know, when that dries, when that dries, it'll dry curly like this, but it'll dry and it'll be soft because it has the she butter in it. But this is the other side of the hair. See how that be? Oh my goodness. All right. So what I did was, it's the hot water, still hot. Uh, my part sucks, y'all. My parting sucks, but that's okay. I just want to show y'all this dry hair and what I did. Usually I'm getting a brush. I don't do, I usually wash this before I put uh, a brush or comb to it. But I'm not even going to put a comb or a brush or nothing to it. I'm just going to spray it with the hot water. Hold on, let me pull this part out because it's in my way. Get that section back there. I'm so lazy, y'all. Look at me. Hold on, y'all. I bought hair clips. Why am I not using them? You know what I'm saying? We have all the tools in life, but we don't use them. Oh, that, look at that. That's another message. My God. Have all the tools. Got all the stuff to section off my hair and do it right. But look at me. Rushing through life. My God. Anyway, so I'm spraying it. I got this towel on me because I hate all that water all up on me like that. All up on me like that. And I'm going through it. As you can see, all the way to the ends. See how that's tangled? Watch that. Hot water, okay? And as that's untangling, by the way, these are, uh, I just freshly 
wash my hair like I said the other day and these products are already in here um it's it's not the curly booster that I showed you but it's the curl pudding that I put in it and I had twisted it that night but as I'm as I'm spraying this hair um with this hot water uh let me section that off come on Reva quit being lazy Jesus you gonna show them show them right do it right it'll come out right that's what Bishop Holland said. Okay, where we going? In here like this, see that? To that, see there? And I have not put, not yet, a comb in my hair. Although, see that? I, I just wiped the extra conditioner and all this stuff that's in my hair, I wipe it on my towel. But um, usually, um, you know, it'll be tangled and then I'll be like, I can't get it. I'll be, and if I do use my finger, um, I, I found out a lot of hair would be on my hands. All right. So as I'm doing that, there's no hardly hair on my hands. I'm going back through it with my leave-in conditioner because it's going to dry. It's going to dry. Oh yeah, it's gonna dry. Now I put a lot of gel in this area, um, so I did forget about that. I put a lot of gel. I didn't put the extreme gel that I just showed y'all, but what I did was I put, uh, where is it at? She probably put it up, Tina. Tina put it up for me in my linen closet. I don't feel like getting up getting it. I know, that's bad. Uh, it's as I am, y'all know, it's defining, uh, a smoothing gel and I put it all up here because I had my hair back yesterday and stuff like that and I had it you know on a ponytail and uh and but it's got a lot of leave uh the the defining gel but that's okay because like I said I'm not, I'm not gonna wash I'm gonna keep washing my moisture that I put in my hair I'm not gonna keep washing that back out so I'm, I'm gonna put some more leave-in conditioner in it because I want to make sure that like I said this part of my hair I want to say it's friendly <laughs> It's friendlier than others. And so what I do to get the uh, excess products out, they say, well, you gotta let that dry and get a hair diffuser. I simply take my hand and I pull it down so to where I got excess left in my hair. Um, and that helps a lot, okay? And when I got as much as out as I want, you see that? Even though that's straight up in there, that's from heat damage. But I am not cutting my hair, okay? I'm not going to cut it. I would love to have a head full of hair just matching this. But it's just up in my top part that it goes straight. It's, it curls, but it doesn't curl and pop as this would. As that's drying. Y'all see how that's looking when it's drying? I'm going to wear it just like that, you know. Put a little edge control. Put a little edge. You know what I'm saying? I'm doing the edges. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And so I'm doing that. And I'm going to take the she butter here and do the same thing I applied on this side. Um, put the she butter in. Jesus, I'm dropping stuff. And I'm doing that. I'm going to put it through my hair. And it feels so soft and good right now. All through my curls at the end. Still like this. And still, it feels good as it goes through. See that? That's the she butter. I'm not gonna put all that stuff, like I said, in my head. I ain't gonna put all the stuff, like I said, in my head. Put all the stuff, like I said, in my head. I'm not gonna put all the stuff in my head, like I said, like I said. Like I said, okay, I'm getting caught up. Okay, all right, so now I'm going in my gel. And I'm going through, I'm going through, apply all that all the way to the edges, to the edges, put a little burn on the edges, pulling it through, pulling it through, pulling it through, pulling it through. Okay, I do need some of that. Clear gel, I'm still using y'all. I, I put that on, on my edges, but I use edge controls for my edge because some folks, some of us, take the hair and make some edges. No, you're supposed to just take, just go, go, go with the look. Look, this is what I got here right here. Look at that. I'm gonna need for y'all to stop doing this. 
and that's my edges. No, no, I'm gonna need for y'all to stop doing that. Take the, that hairline back. This is my hairline. Now watch, I'm gonna take this little small comb and whatever come out, them my edges. Hello, them as edges. Take them and swerve them. Take them and put, where's it at? Take, the, take them and put even on it. Stop putting even all on a hair, on a hair. Okay, okay, so that's that. The front part, this top, here I go, I'm going in again. Drop my hair, my spray bottle. Hold on, y'all. My God, my God from glory. I just want y'all to know that I'm having a blessed, wonderful day. Thanking God for life, health, and strength. Look at that. Y'all see that? You see that? That's uh, that is uh, that's not relaxed here on the end. That's 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 heat damage. Okay, so I'm going in. And I'm wetting it. Cause this, I'm telling you, when they get up here, ooh, my hair is so nappy. My hair, I tell you, my hair. I got my daddy's hair. I'm my daddy's child. Okay, all right. So yeah. All right, and I'm proud of it. Happy to be nappy, boo. I'm going to get to the part where I'm... See how I can't get through that? There you go. There you go. Come on out. Come out. Receive it. Hold up. Hold up. I told y'all this nappy here back here. So hold up. There you go. There you go. There you go. I don't know why the top middle crown of my head to the back part in the middle is like I don't like you Reba and I'm gonna give you a hard time but the sides and the front and the back is like I love you girl I, go. I got that in I just want to show y'all how I'm telling y'all this is amazing to me I'm learning my hair every day like I said this is amazing to me because I was breaking my hair out even like I said when I use my uh my fingers I mean my yeah when I use uh, my fingers and even not even the comb or a brush or whatever type of you know we supposed to use for hair comb it was still even though I use my fingers it was pulling out it was pulling my hair well, I was like, damn, I'm supposed to have this hair out dry and stuff, and I didn't put all this moisture in there the day before. And it's not doing that now. And I don't have all that. Look at that, see? The, and ain't nothing wrong with putting all this water, y'all. Our hair needs that. I was looking at some tutorials, y'all. And on them tutorials, uh, this hair, this naturalist, when she does hair, uh, a natural hair she's a ha natural hairstylist and she was like we never need to towel dry or put uh i don't care if you use a t-shirt she said we never supposed to use any of that in our hair we're just supposed to put a towel around our neck and let it dry like like let it drip i mean i'm sorry and then you take your hand as i'm doing and as you apply your products when they get ready and start drying up you know because when you section it off by the time you get to the top part of your hair it's almost dry so she said keep your spray bottle and keep it hydrated you know hydrated real good like I'm doing now it's coming out see that how that just come and that ain't nothing but water it ain't nothing but water and that's all the way to my roots y'all it's all the way to my all the way to my roots so you see how that's turning out that's water all the way to my root now it's gonna soften when I put in my leave-in conditioner I love this stuff y'all I live by this stuff so, Hands are slippery all through my, all through my hair. Oh my God, that's so soft. That is so soft. Wow, that's dripping. All that's on there. See that? The big clump I used and showed y'all. That's, that's smooth. See that? Probably no hair on my hands. Probably no hair. And I didn't even use the doggone. And I got the, I got the, um, see? Where my big comb? This I usually use. Um, and this I usually use. Um, I'm only gonna use this when I'm kind of like straightening my hair and um, stuff like that. But um, and so now it's dripping. I said it's gonna be drippy and stuff. So you want to get the excess out because you don't want it all wet when you go to put your stuff out. See that? I take and pull it and I let the excess fall all onto my towel. 
y'all know gross right but it's nothing but conditioner conditioner it's all it is so calm down it's key <laughs> and that's that dry i mean um i did that part section off now i'm going like i said with my she butter because you know i'm not like i said i'm just trying to be sitting here section and all this stuff i don't feel like doing that you know what i'm saying my she butter So put the sheet butter in my hand. All through the ends of my hair. Do it right, it's gonna come out right. Do it right, it's gonna come out right. Okay. A little bit more, cause that's the snappy back there. All up in there, I ain't playing. I'm sorry y'all, I ain't trying to front, but I ain't gonna say, I just only apply just to, no, I'm applying it, okay, hold on. I just don't want all that. They could be killing me with that little diamond mount. All you need is a little diamond mount. Because the product works all over the head. No. All this hair I got. I'll swallow up just a little piece of corner of my head. And I just got this little section in the back. I just wanted to show y'all. It ain't nothing that y'all don't already know. But like some of us don't. You know I just wanted to share the part with y'all where it's like. You know, we're uh, putting, now I gotta get to this part. Now that's why I should have sectioned it off and probably did the back first, but I did it out of order. You see how, if you don't, you don't do it in order that it should, it makes it hard, you know what I'm saying? That's the lesson in life too. So I'm going to the back part. Basically doing the same thing. My back part is so easy, so it's just a little section that's left back here that I'm gonna take in on my hair through my fingers, putting the water on it. Yeah. I wanna make sure, hold on, you wanna get enough. Make sure we got enough out. I wanna get a hold of it in my hand, pull it through a little bit like this. And then I wanna come through with the water because I want it in, inside the part so it could just slide on through my fingers. Now the back part. It's a little tangly, but it's still, it's coming on through. Come on through. Come on through. Come on. Come on, push through, baby. Push through, baby. That's what we're doing. And I'm enjoying this. I'm enjoying wearing my hair like this. Um, I, I never would. Back in the day, I'd be like, I ain't wearing them. Naps around in my head, talking about something. That's our hair. Oh, my hair look terrible. Because, you know, people make you feel like that. Your hair ugly. My hair is beautiful. I'm so mad all these years. It took me to get old to find out I had some uh, beautiful hair. It took me to get old and go through things in life to accept myself and love myself. Okay, that's the second part. Just comes on through. Now, I did, I'm going to be honest with y'all, back here was a little tangled more and I did it and I said I probably wouldn't have been like that, but it was a little bit more tangled more that I sat and did this. And I'm going to show y'all the difference in mainly getting to it because I couldn't get to it good because I did it out of order. Had, not, had I had I did the back first and did it in order, I wouldn't have had that problem. But since I didn't and I did the front first and hit the back, I couldn't get to it like I wanted to. So therefore, there's my results with all the hair in my hand. You see there? Do it right. Hair. See? See? See what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? If you would have did it in order, you wouldn't have had that. But it's all good, man. You live and learn. And then you get loves. No, I'm playing. This is that diaper commercial. Remember that diaper commercial, y'all? You live and you learn. And then you get loves. Okay, so leave in conditioner spray. Oh, it's going through beautiful now. It's going through. I'm taking. There it is. Excess, baby. <laughs> I'm not gonna have all that sticking gook in my hair. Like, look at her hair, it look nasty. I'm not gonna have that. And that's dry enough, cause I took all the ex excess out. I don't want, you know, dry it. See how that fell? No curls. They have all go with the she butter. The she butter, ugly. Mm. 
Glory, glory, hallelujah, since I lay my burdens down, burdens down, Lord, burdens down, Lord, since I lay my burdens down. Friends, don't treat me like they used to, since I lay my burdens down, burdens down, Lord. It's ready. Yeah, she touched a little bit. She touched. She crazy. Some about her off. No, I'm just my happy, happy go lucky free self. Lay your burdens down and you'll feel like me. Hair gel. Here I go. There I go. There I go. There it is. Receive it. Receive. There it is, y'all. Whole hairstyle of curls without. So y'all, how it looks in the top? That's gonna dry. It's not gonna look like they are. It's not gonna look like they are. Um, that's a whole head of hair. Use with your hot water. Leave-in conditioner, she butter, gel, and your finger. The reason why I said finger, the hair on my lip. Oh, oh. Gee, oh. Oh, gee. You ever met them uppity folks? Oh, she, oh, oh, her spirit. Oh, Jesus. Girl, bye. All right, so I'm going in with the edges. A little burn on the edges. Okay, I'm just going in here like this. I'm going to go down like this. Like that. See that? Look at that. Look at that. See that? And I'm just gonna my edge control like that. Oh here, that's all I don't know where I get a widower's peak from, but I love it. You know, it's so good. It's so good. Cause when I look at my mother forehead, I don't see that widower's peak. See it in my daddy either. Maybe he got one. I don't know. Okay. So I'm coming in and I'm basically gonna Edges, edges, not the hair. Don't do that. Okay, y'all, I'm not as professional as some of y'all with these edges. So don't talk about me. I'm swooping them and trying to fleek, fleek them, as y'all say, the best way I can. This, I guess this is the new way of doing them. Back in the day, it was this, y'all. I'm going to show y'all how they did the edges in the 70s and the 80s. <laughs> they take that strain <laughs> and they go like this. And they used to, the, 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 you know, look. <laughs> I'm so glad y'all young folks, a generation come along and say, you know what? Uh-uh. You is not doing it like that. So. Uh, I'm not going to hide my water respect to it. I love my water respect. So that's going to dry like that just a little. I don't like, I'm, I ain't trying to do all nothing fancy with these edges. I'm just trying to make it work. Okay. Make it work. That's all I'm trying to do. I had my edges done so good one time, y'all. Somebody was like, girl, I thought you had on a lace front. I, I thought you had on one of them lace fronts that come with the uh, baby hair. I was like, Why? that's a compliment. I hate that. Hold on, let me take that out of there. I hate that. Yeah, I don't like the way that looks. This little edge. That's, that's all. I just want it like that. Did it again. I want that. Bring it down a peg or two. Uh, peg or two. Uh, peg or two. So that's it, y'all. I just wanted to show y'all. This is going to dry like this. It's not all. It's not soaking wet because, remember, I when I put the water in it, I drained, I mean, the water and the leave-in conditioner, I took and drained it on the on the towel. So it made it, like, easier, fat, well, faster to dry. And, um, when that dries, that's going to you know, that's going to puff up and then not be able to, you know, take and do, put some, you know, some height and depth into it. But I just wanted to share it with y'all and uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Have a blessed day in Jesus name. Peace out.